So it's a little broader stretch, but it opens up the same. Okay, man? Mm-hmm. Okay. Nice. There, uh, for release points in uh, shiatsu, there's a couple of very admirable release points here, right in the teres muscle. So, using the crease of the armpit and come right above the crease of the armpit, you find teres when you go in. Okay, and you can do circular uh, friction here, or you can approach it with your elbow here. That pressure's okay? Yep. Um, you can take your arm like this, be sure where the teres is, and use forearm so you can sink in with your body weight a little bit more. It really helps open up the shoulder girdle. <coughs> and then two last things for shoulder girdle will stop there. It's going to come up like this. So here's the transition down here. You come up on one knee and one foot. The arm come here so your business is right in front of you here. And what we're trying to do, a little uh, forwardness in the shoulder, so we're going to loosen pec major and pec minor. Okay. And one of the reasons we're doing that on a uh, muscular level, let the shoulder come back, but on, a, on an energetic level, there's three meridians of the arm that start right in this area. So you want to have some little, uh, some concentration here to allow this openness to come in. So uh, the energy of the uh, lung, pericardium, and heart, which happen to start in and around the arm here, can open up. So for pec major, I'm going to take my thumbs under. Fingers on top, and I'm going to inhale, and on the exhale, it's going to lean back, rolling this tissues out between my fingertips. Meow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so this is braced and just letting your body weight fall back easy. And then lastly, I'm going to take these fingertips and come up underneath the pec major and go right into the lateral border of pec minor. Um, so you don't spend any time poking around trying to find a pec minor. I would suggest going underneath the pec major and going just until you hit the ribs and then slide up on the ribs and you go right into the lateral border of pec minor. And we can check that by bringing up. Oh. So just that pin and stretch. <laughs> so that's pretty deep. That's pretty releasing digital compression. And this position is really good because you can get pec major and pec minor. You know, so so let's just end there. Give him a chance to heal, <laughs> and then we'll continue uh, into. Yeah, let's just try that much, okay?